using beta function evaluate the following integral integration 0 to 4 x cube divided by square root of 4 minus x dx before solving the integration let us recall few formula beta mn is integration 0 to 1 x power m minus 1 1 minus x power n minus 1 dx this is the beta function then the relation between beta and gamma function beta m n equals to gamma m gamma n divided by gamma m plus n and gamma n plus 1 equals to n gamma n and gamma n equals to factorial n minus 1. Integration 0 to 4 x cube divided by square root of 4 minus x dx. If we compare with beta function, as we know beta mn equals to integration 0 to 1 x power n minus 1 1 minus x power n minus 1 dx without learning any other form of beta function how can we do the sum look here upper limit is 4 and here in the beta function upper limit is 1 and if we take the denominator as numerator, then in the quotient it is 4 and here in the function it is 1. So let us make this 4 as 1. So how to make it? Let us take 4 common and square root of 4 is 2. Then we will have 1 minus x by 4 dx. Let us substitute x by 4 as t then dx is 4 dt and when x equals to 0 t is 0 x equals to 4 t is 1. Okay so the limits will be changed 0 to 1 and here 1 by 2 x cube is 4t whole cube and below square root of 1 minus t and dx is 4 dt. Here 4 cube and 4 and there is 2 so cancelling 1 2 and 2 cube and 2 square cube 2 to the power 6 and 2, 2 to the power 7, integration 0 to 1, t cube, 1 minus t power minus half dt. So we have 2 to the power 7, integration 0 to 1, t cube, 1 minus t power minus half dt. Now if we make this integration in the form of beta function then we will have t to the power 4 minus 1 and 1 minus t to the power we have to make it n minus 1 form n minus 1 equals to minus half so n equals to 1 minus half that is half only so we can write half minus 1 dt now we can write this as beta 4 half okay and we can apply the relation between beta and gamma function beta mn is gamma m gamma m divided by gamma m plus n so we'll have gamma 4 gamma 
half and divide it by gamma log plus half. Go to the power 7, gamma 4 is factorial 3. As we know, gamma n is factorial n minus 1. And gamma half, let us write as it is gamma half. And gamma 4 plus half can be written as gamma um, 7 by 2 plus 1. So 7 by 2 gamma 7 by 2. So this is 2 to the power 7 into 3 into 2 into 1 into gamma half and divided by 7 by 2. Gamma 7 by 2 is 5 by 2. Gamma 7 by 2 can be written as 5 by 2 plus 1. So that is 5 by 2 gamma 5 by 2. And gamma 5 by 2 can be written as 3 by 2 plus 1. So this is 5 by 2 into 3 by 2 gamma 3 by 2. And gamma 3 by 2 can be written as half plus 1. So half gamma half. Therefore here 5 by 2 into 3 by 2 into half into gamma half. So gamma half, gamma half cancel and here we can write 2 to the power 8 and there are 1, 2, 3, 4, 2 to the power 4 and 1, 3 is cancelled below 7 into 5, 35. So in the numerator it is 2 to the power 12 divided by 35. This is the required answer. Another way to solve this integration 0 to 4 x cube by square root of 4 minus x dx. If we know the formula a to b x minus a power m minus 1 b minus x power n minus 1 dx is b minus a power m plus n minus 1 beta mn. Now if we compare with this then b is 4 and a is 0. Therefore 4 minus 0 power 4 minus 0 power m is 4 minus 1 that is 4 and n is half minus 1 so that is half minus 1 beta 4 half that is 4 power 7 by 2 beta 4 half. But 2 to the power 7 beta 4 half. If you would like to understand this one, 0 to 4 x cube. 4 minus x power minus half dx. So this is 0 to 4 x minus 0 power 4 minus 1 and 4 minus x power half minus 1 dx. In this way here m is 4 and m is half. Now you can apply this formula here and work out and rest of the part 
you can do like before.